Today, I'm going to show you how you can get unlimited amounts of data from LinkedIn for free. And when I mean free, I mean 100% free, no strings attached. All you do is enter in a LinkedIn URL and get a nice CSV, Excel, or JSON of your LinkedIn data. Hello guys, I'm Mike, and I'm here to help you make more money and save time in your life or business. Make sure to join the free school community with the link down in the description below, where we talk about all things AI and automation. And also stay tuned because I'm going to be dropping some courses real soon, which are going to be absolute bangers. But anyway, enough talk. Let's get into scraping data from LinkedIn for free. So I'm over on my tool called Scrape Table. You can find it at scrapetable.com. And what it is, is a free data collection tool. And when I mean free, I mean 100% free. There is no way I can collect payments other than your generous donations, which I really, really, really do appreciate. And it's how the site stays afloat. But all you have to do is head on over to Scrape Table, and when you're over here, make sure you like us on Product Hunt. I'm trying to boost the Product Hunt numbers, so if you do that, it means a lot to me. So go over there, please give us a like, and then head on over to get started for free. And then you'll see we have our Google Maps search data. So if you're looking for free Google Maps search data, you can click on this one right here. But today we're gonna to be checking out the brand new tab, the LinkedIn profile search data right here, which is awesome so this is really really as simple as it looks you just put in your linkedin urls right in this inbox and then click on search and i kind of want to show you guys another tool that i made that will allow us to get linkedin urls in bulk that you can then feed in to this right here if we head on over to appify i actually made this linkedin url scrape a while back ago and it's been a great way to get linkedin urls in bulk for free so all we're going to do is just try this out on appify you can get it with the link in the description below and I'm just gonna log in here and we'll give this a run so you can come on over to the input here and you can add in some keywords that we're going to search for I'm just gonna search for automotive and also in the and also is a sales rep here so now we have automotive sales reps and then we can pick the number of pages that we want and then we can pick the number of pages we want to scrape I'm gonna choose 30 for this and then we just save and start and it will bring us to our run tab here over in Appify where it will go through and start searching Google and scraping Google for any and all LinkedIn URLs that fit those keywords. So you can see it's just doing its thing, going through each URL and then scraping all the URLs from those pages. And then at the very end here, it says you found 219 LinkedIn URLs across 30 pages. We can go to output up here and we can see all of the people we got from our scraper. And if we click on the most recent person here, we'll see that they are a sales rep for an automotive paint sales rep. That's really interesting. What if we check out this person here? So they're also an automotive sales rep right there, right? So now we got all these people that we can use to put inside of our LinkedIn search scraper. So I'm gonna export these results. You can export them however you like. I'm just gonna pick CSV here. I do not have Excel, so I'm gonna open this up in Google Sheets here. And we have all of our URLs right here. So I can just take a row like so. We can do up to 50 URLs at a time. So I'll do 51, which will include the first row right up here. I'll copy all of these people. I'll head back over to scrape table and then I'll just put all 50 of these people inside of our search filter right here. And you'll notice we need to put all these URLs inside of a row like so, just like this. Um, without any additional spaces, without any additional lines. It needs to be just a clean, solid block of information of all of these LinkedIn URLs. This is exactly how you wanna do it. You'll notice if we put in more than 50 URLs, it won't actually work and tell us to delete some URLs here. And the same thing, it won't work if we have an extra space here. So it needs to be just a straight block of URLs inside of the input here. And then once we're all ready to go, we just click on search. And if we just give it a couple seconds here, you'll notice we got our, you found the profiles of 50 people, which we can then download as a CSV, Excel, or JSON. I will pick CSV. And then as we did before, I'll go over here into Google Sheets and then I'll open this up in Google Sheets. And if we check this out, we get all of our information scraped from the person's LinkedIn profile page. So we got everything from first name to last name to the full name here, the public identifier, so that being their LinkedIn handle, their headline of the person, their connections, their followers, this identifier here, country they're in, their address, and then also any experiences, which is where they work and the position that they have right now. Isn't that awesome? So we get this nice CSV file here of all of this great data. Let's try this out one more time with a different search filter inside of Appify. 
So I'll head on back over to input here. We're gonna do developer and we're gonna type in United States. And let's save and start this and see what we come up with. And it looks like we're gonna find 269 people across 30 pages. Awesome. So we can head back over to output. We can head back over to output here and we have all of our people. If we click into one, you'll notice we have software developer inside of the United States. So we can click on export here. I'll export this also as a CSV and I'll just open this up inside of Google Sheets as well here. We'll copy 50 more URLs, but obviously you're free to get these URLs from wherever you like. This is just the easiest way for me. And we got 50 more profiles inside of our LinkedIn profile search data here. And all we gotta do once again, is just click on search. And a couple seconds later, we'll be able to see, we got you found the profiles of 50 people, which we can then download as a CSV Excel or JSON. I'll pick CSV. And if we check this out inside of Google Sheets here, we get all of our data once again, like before. Everything and including even other experiences right here. First name, last name, full name, public identifiers, connections, followers, addresses here, experiences, and all of the good stuff you need. So once again, you can get started using Scrape Table and the LinkedIn Profile Search Data Scraper for free by checking out the link in the description below. And also, if you do want to keep Scrape Table running, feel free to donate. And that's pretty much going to do it. If you like this video, make sure to give it a fat like. It really, really does help me out. And also subscribe. There's going to be a ton more great automation content coming out in the near future here. So make sure you subscribe to stay tuned for all that. And if you haven't already, check Check out this video here where I show you how to scrape data from Google Maps for free all on Scrape Table. It's real similar except it's just a demo showing you the Google Maps side of things. So I'll see you guys over in that video.